Coverage you can count on continues. This is News Channel 15's First News Weekend. It's a new beginning for a new group of people. Fort Wayne's smallest winter competition will kick off their sixth season tomorrow. Rick Walters is the co-founder of the organization. Thank you for being here with us. Thanks for having me. And the competition is really life-changing, right? Absolutely. Uh, we take people that are uh, in need of serious life change. Uh, uh, they're not healthy. They, they're not feeling good. And, uh, and, we, and we change their lives. And the new season starts tomorrow. Yes. Uh, is the excitement there? Oh, excitement? yeah, everybody's so excited. Uh, we've already had our orientation. Uh, tomorrow we'll start with our first nutrition class and their weigh-in. And then uh, Tuesday morning we get up bright and early and uh, start hitting it. And for those of us who aren't familiar with the competition, what is it? It's, uh, it's similar to The Biggest Loser. Uh, we train people hard and intense for 15 week weeks uh, with a, a nutrition class once a week. And I, I basically, I call it a boot camp. It's very intense. Uh, they sign some things that they're not going to do for 15 weeks. And, and we try to lose as much weight as we can and, and change their way of thinking and, and their way of eating uh, so it sticks with them the rest of their life. Great. Now, you started this event. And what does it mean to you to see new people and alumni that have really been successful with this? Uh, that's, that's what motivates us to keep, to keep doing it. Um, we have alumni that train with the new people, the people that have continued to be successful, and we hear their stories of how things, how it's affected their lives and their families and their workplace, and uh, it, that's, that's all the feedback and motivation we need to keep doing it and keep going on. Wonderful. Now, the, the contestants have a lot on their plates this year. Oh, absolutely, yeah. Uh, we, give, we try to give them a taste of every kind of training possible, hoping that uh, what doesn't work for one person will work for another. So we're, we're in the pool, we're out running on, on the Aboit trails, uh, we're in the gym with conventional weights, and we're pushing sleds and flipping tires and moving ropes. And, and hopefully, uh, well, plus there are, there are classes, um, and hopefully one of those sticks with them and they say, you know what, I enjoy this, this is fun, mm -hmm. and it makes me feel good, and, and I want to do this forever. Yeah. Losing weight and, you know, eating right and being healthy, it can be difficult. I know that firsthand. What uh, advice would you, are you giving these contestants and maybe people that are trying to stay healthy? Well, it, it's funny you ask that because this, this morning I heard on the news that they, there's a new study and they said genetically they've determined that some people like exercise and it gives them a good feeling and some people uh, it gives them a bad feeling. Well, I disagree with that 100%. If you stick with it long enough, it's an acquired taste. Mm -hmm. You will learn to enjoy this feeling of being alive and sweat coming down your face. Even if you, it's just putting your headphones on and being alone for an hour while you're moving, um, it, it truly is something. If you stick with it long enough, you will like it. You'll fall in love with it, and um, it'll make your life, the quality of your life, much better. Great. Right. Now, there is a public division. Will that be going on? Yes. Uh, the public division exploded this year. We had 100 last year. We're just shy of 200 this year, and that includes a couple of uh, public nutrition classes, a couple of public workouts, plus tons of advice that will be on our website. Okay. And it, it's f to encourage them to follow our program on their own, and hopefully at the end of the program we'll, we'll have a winner there, and they'll be hugely successful too. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you. 